Hi guys, and welcome to Letter of the Week Lunches. Today we'll learn about the letter C. And C is for cow. For today's lunch, I'm starting with this really cute napkin. It has a cow print on it. And then for our C themed lunch, I'm starting with a cheddar cheese sandwich. And to make it really cute, I used a combination of two different cookie cutters. In the back section of our lunchbox, I'm going to add a combination of cucumbers and carrots. This is really easy to do. I just use my mini cookie cutters for this. There really are a lot of foods that start with the letter C. Next up, I'm going to add some clementines. And no, I'm not gonna juggle these, but I am gonna make them really cute. I went ahead and peeled the top of the clementine, but I left the bottom. That way I can place them in the lunchbox and they will stay together. And there'll be just enough room to add a special surprise. I'm gonna add one maraschino cherry to the center of each of these clementines. And it's gonna make our clementines look like flowers. I'm pretty sure Lily <laughs> is going to love these. Next up, I'm going to add some whole wheat crackers. And to go with them, of course, I'm gonna add some more cheese. And this one is totally appropriate for today's lunch because it's the Laughing Cow Cheese. Let me know in the comments down below if you've ever had this cheese. I think it's actually pretty good. Next up, I'm going to add just a few of these Alphabet Mini Cookies. I found these at Walmart, and I'm just gonna put in the ones that have a C on them. And then I do have a special treat for the center of our lunchbox. These are fruity cows. These are so cute. It's just like a regular gummy, but in a cow shape. And there you have it. I know she's gonna love it, but before she digs in, I have some fun activities. Starting with the adorable cow plate mask. For this, we're going to use a paper plate, some construction paper in both pink and black. You need scissors. We have some glue, we have a black marker, and a stapler. And don't forget the googly eyes. I get these at the Dollar Tree and they are so fun. Now like I said, this is super easy. Lily's just gonna cut out all of the shapes and then build her cow face. And here's a tip, if you want your cow to be extra cute, don't forget the eyelashes. She needs some eyelashes. And there it is, her cow came out so cute. Next up, I have another really simple but really fun activity. And I actually did this activity when I was in elementary school. You know, not a lot of kids have the opportunity to actually milk a real cow. So this is kind of similar to that. I'm just gonna take one latex glove, the kind you might use for cleaning up around the house. And then to this, I'm going to take a Sharpie and I'm going to draw just a few little cow print shapes all over the glove. You could definitely skip this part. I think it makes it look really cute though. Next, we're gonna fill this glove with water and poke one hole in the fingertip of the glove. That way, Lily can actually get an idea of what milking a real cow might be like. Let us know in the comments down below if you've ever milked a real cow. And without further ado, it's lunchtime. <laughs> Cows. <clears throat> See you later. 